This is a push-pull circuit composed of transistors. When the input drive voltage is 5 volts, the voltage across the load is 4.3 volts. When 5 volts is directly applied to the base, the transistor's base emitter junction will have a fixed 0.7 volt voltage drop, so the voltage across the load is 5 volts minus 0.7 volts, which equals 4.3 volts. So where did the 12 volts go? Actually, it is divided across the collector emitter junction of the transistor, meaning that the voltage difference between the collector and emitter of Q1 is 7.7 .7 volts, but only 4.3 volts is applied to the load. Therefore, when driving the load in this way, the transistor heats up significantly. When the push-pull circuit input is at low voltage, Q1 will instantly turn off because the base emitter voltage is suddenly reverse biased. At this point, the output voltage remains high, so the emitter base junction of Q2 becomes forward biased, and the high output voltage is directly pulled to ground by Q2. It is important to note that when the output voltage drops to 0.7 volts, Q2 will turn off. Ultimately, the voltage will be 0 volts.